So we're at top of the second, it's Skaven turn. Rin did the first thing you do in the movement phase, which is declare chargers. He's declared one here. I'm gonna hold. He has to declare one here because of frenzy. And how you do that is after all the charges are declared, then, because you can't measure the charges, then you see if anything's in range of the frenzied units. Now we know these are within 10 inches, it's pretty obvious. But let's see how far away they are. They're in about a seven and a half, eight inch charge. So my charge reaction here is to flee. So here's how that works. I take 3d6, because these guys move seven inches or more. Six inches or less to roll two dice. And then I roll the flee distance. Okay, they flee 12 inches. So they're gonna end up passing through this unit of Blackguard. And we go exactly the opposite direction so we take their center, the center of the fleeing unit, and then that forms a perfect line, and that's the line these guys have to follow. They turn to a perpendicular thing, and then they take off. Now these guys normally would be required to make a panic check, which you do like this. However, the black guard, black guard! Black guard! Thanks, Rin's looking at me like, Really? You want to do that on camera? Yes, yes I do. Blackguard! Blackguard! Hey, you're not allowed to do Blackguard, you little skaven. I the did, skaven's... I, I did the, it anyway. The subtitle is Blackguard, but really it comes out squeak, squeak. <laughs> so, uh, anyway. But skaven and then don't now, squeak. Uh, these guys the move directly towards them. So, they end up, basically they end up wheeling five inches and they end up something like this. Yeah, pretty much. So, whoop hard to yeah. do this and hold the camera at the so same time. what you try and do with the fleeing uh, fast cavalry is you try and get someone to expose their flank and I didn't really do that very well here I should have angled these guys a little harder so that they first off they wouldn't flee through my own unit of course fleeing through these guys would be bad but those are well out of 18 inch range um, but the other thing is, I may have wanted to have flanked with this unit here. Of course, this is unbreakable, and I've already had a pretty bad experience charging my black guard into the front of a, uh, <laughs> front of a, because of all its toughness tests. They just never get any hits in, because it's like, make toughness tests, make more toughness tests. And guess what? Toughness tests. And then they just, like the front rank is just kind of falling over from the gas, you know. <laughs> the the, uh, the plague monks eat a lot of uh, Mexican food right before the battle. That's how they, that's how they get it. It's not really the warp stone. They really just kind of. It's not like, the. Uh, mm. the All right, of heat the, uh, up the ten thousand frozen chimichangas. <laughs> that's how you say that too. I'm sure. You know, I'm sure I'll get crap for that too. Probably. It's not chimichanga. It's chimichanga. It's not what? plague. It's plague. 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 Plague monks. Plague. <laughs> yeah. well, at least they're not plug monks. Good old you Utah know. accent. You could have you could have done worse with that. Yep, yep. So why why are we still filming? I don't know. Yeah, that's a good question. This is gonna go poorly for me. So let's yeah. crunch these guys in. Crunch tastic. Most guys. That is four. All right. I'm ready. Go. Ha ha! Bendy red thing of doom. Okay. So this wizard attempted to cast the Vermintide spell, but it was dispelled with my two dispel dice. Um, then he attempted to cast Wither um, on this unit, and that was affected by the Ring of Hotek. And uh, since Rain rolled double twos, he got a miscast. Miscast result was five, so that meant I got to cast one of my own spells. Oh, yeah, I don't have any wizards, so it was no effect, but basically that carried the day for the magic phase, which made me happy. Ring of Hotek. It's pretty weird. It's a weird, wild, wacky item. Yeah. Okay, warp fire thrower. Shooting at that. Shooting at those guys, and here it comes. Forward. Oh, this couldn't be worse for me! Six inches. Oh, wow. Wow. Yeah, that's right there. That's, uh... All it needs to do is touch them. Yeah, I know. All right, ten guys. Ten guys? Strength two, no save, right? Isn't that no, how that strength works? Strength five. Strength five, no save? Maybe or just strength five? Or save. Oh, which will be no save. So I have a feeling this is going to peel off quite a few guys. Because you've got two ups and yeah. I have effectively no save. 
Eight, okay, dead. eight guys. So this is the great thing about these movement trays and to split the trays, which is how we do it. So two guys are left. All right, that was a very good showing for a warp fire thrower, which can yeah. basically do nothing quite easily. All right, okay, one. now this one. Oh boy, wow. Oh, oh no! <laughs> also the perfect distance. All right, give me an eight inch forward thing. Okay, eight inches. Yeah. Oh, this is even worse than the first one. Okay. Uh, probably 15 minus three. So that's 12, guys. Okay. Killed on two ups. Wow, that was some great roll in there, Ren. And, uh, okay, so 12. 12 roll. 12, guys. Yeah, let's do it. Two ups. Yeah, two ups. So 12. Ten. Ten guys die. So here we go. And that's why I like more fighting yeah, that was pretty brutal. Well, could that I, could have... Could I have asked for more? Not much that. more. I don't the think only so. way it could have gone better would have been to have gotten like two inches more on two this one. On and then that yeah. would have taken out a yeah. couple more guys. But yeah, that was bad. All right, in here, Skaven shooting. Um, I fired the warp fire throwers at those guys. Killed ten there. Um, that one fired at those guys. Killed eight there. How could I ask for more, right? Um, that fired over... Hit, just wounded one guy, killed one guy. And I think that's it for machine. Oh, wait, wait, I got one more. Um, hey, Sean, can I get the flamethrower template from you? There's no flamethrower template over here. What? No, if you can't find the template, you can't shoot the warp fire. I'm not shooting. No. Wait. Hey. Hey, go, go. Hey, Sean. What? No! I need the I need the flamethrower template! No! No! Come on! Flamethrower template! No! Hey! Hey! I'm, I'm really getting tired of this! Stop! Running! Hey! No! How are you doing this? Hey! How are you doing this? Hey! No! Sean! I need the template! Why are you doing this? No! Hey! Hey! <laughs> <laughs>